If you've opened Google Maps recently and thought, wait, where did my account switcher go? You're not alone. Google just updated the Maps app with a brand new interface for switching between accounts. And yeah, it looks a bit different. So in this video, I'll show you exactly how to switch accounts in the new Google Maps layout step by step without the stress. First off, the redesign is part of Google's ongoing updates to align all its apps under something called Material U. That's why things might feel a bit cleaner or more rounded. The account switcher has moved from a simple drop down to more of a full screen setup. So let's walk through how it works now. So open Google Maps and make sure that your app is updated to the latest version on Android or iOS. And then look in the top right corner of the screen and tap on the circular profile photo. This opens the new full screen account menu. So you'll see a greeting message as you can see here. Mine says, hi, Supreme Guru. And you'll see your email and buttons like manage your account and your profile. So if you look just below that, you will see the switch account option. So tap to expand the switch account menu. And here you'll see the Google accounts you've previously logged into. Just tap on the one you want and Google Maps will instantly switch to that account. If you scroll to the bottom of this option, you can see add another account if needed and you would just follow the login prompts and it will be added to your switcher lists. Uh, but is this better than the old way? Honestly, it depends. The full screen layout definitely looks more modern and gives you easier access to settings, but it might feel like overkill if you're used to tapping and switching super fast. Some users on Reddit and forums have said it takes a bit longer now, especially for people who switch accounts multiple times a day. But once you get used to it, it is pretty smooth and that's basically it. 